Hey, Freedom Gate Church. I'd like to do something I don't typically do, and that is to give probably about a three-minute tag from Sunday's message. Uh, you may remember the message was about it's real, and I gave four different points that evil is real, spiritual warfare is real, governing is real, and of course the kingdom of God is real. And in the kingdom of God the Father demonstrates and is motivated by love. This is actually my action or engagement points uh, that I kind of either ran out of time or didn't mean to but skipped over that everything we do is empowered by love you know the scripture says for God so loved the world that he gave us his only begotten son and so in Paul in 1 Corinthians 13 I like to say it this way we operate by faith he mentions faith we are a people of hope yet we in everything we do we demonstrate love and in that passage 1 Corinthians 13 Paul says the greatest of these is love so our engagement in culture in community in family in government and in all we do has these concepts of we do it by faith we're a people of hope we believe that God's going to demonstrate great power and great change but we do so in love and the next thing was is prayer uh, that intercession is so powerful that we cannot leave out intercession when we're talking about dealing with the reality of evil or spiritual warfare or governing because in the kingdom of God prayer is God's weapon uh, the word says Ephesians 6 we wrestle not against flesh and blood so if you'd hold there one second I have to go grab my book this is so powerful. This is Paul Bilheimer in his book, Destined for the Throne. John Wesley said, God will do nothing but an answer to prayer. This is why S.D. Gordon said that the greatest thing anyone can do for God and for man is to pray. He also said, I love this, you can do more than pray after you have prayed, but you cannot do more than pray until you have prayed. This also explains his other statement, prayer is striking the winning blow, service is gathering up the results. So from our message on Sunday, our action part of this is that we are motivated by the power of God, the love of God. We are people of faith that move out of move in hope. And when we engage in intercession with that as our foundation, we will see things drastically change. Thank you.